If a polynomial equation has integer coefficients, then any rational zero must be in the form of plus or minus p divided by q, where p is a factor of the constant term and q is a factor of the leading coefficient. This is according to rational zero theorem. For example, let's find the rational zeros of 2x to the third plus 3x squared minus 8x plus 3. Here, q is equal to the factors of 2, which are 2 and 1, and p is equal to the factors of 3, which are 3 and 1. This gives us plus or minus 3 over 2, plus or minus 3, plus or minus 1 over 2, and plus or minus 1. So we actually have 8 possible answers here, which we organize into this table. We then perform synthetic division to obtain our remainders. Here, there is no remainder when dividing by negative 3, by 1 half, and by 1. So those are our three zeros. That is to say that f of negative 3 is equal to 0, f of 1 half is equal to 0, and f of 1 is equal to 0. Here we have found our three zeros using rational zero theorem.